Adrian Martinez, he's gotten so much criticism because he was supposed to be all of that Heisman Trophy candidate, uh, had to suffer through injuries, had a pretty subpar 2019. Last year, he loses his job after a couple of games. He comes back and he started making, I don't want to say all the throws, but he was extremely accurate when he came back and he just seemed like, he had something to prove. Maybe he just gained confidence. Something, man, he completed almost 72% of his passes. Yeah, Sutton just kind of snapped there, I think, uh, getting benched and uh, watching Luke McCaffrey take his job uh, lit a fire under him. And, I, I, you know, I think he might have grown up a little bit there in uh, a couple of weeks. And uh, the big difference now is that we all know it's, it's his show this year. Yeah, it's he doesn't have anybody nipping right there on his heels, uh, trying to take his job. So, uh, you know that that should make things a lot easier on him. I would imagine going into this spring, um, we didn't get a chance to hear from him today, unfortunately. But yeah, I mean he should be going in, you know, with all the confidence in the world. The way he ended up last season, and uh, that's kind of the guy that we've been waiting to see, and um, you know. He's got, if all things work out, he's probably got more talent surrounding him right now at, at every position, and uh, it's time for him to shine. Behind him, you know, you've got you've got a freshman in Logan Smothers who, who he, he's the future of, of the position there at Nebraska, and uh, then you got a, an incoming freshman with, with Heinrich Harper. So, uh, yeah, it, it's, it's his show, and, uh, you know, let, let, it's time to see what he's going to do. And, uh, you know, if he plays well, Nebraska plays well. So, yeah, that's the quarterback position. That's pretty easy, you know, right there. <laughs> over 1,000 yards passing, four TDs, three picks, seven rushing touchdowns on the ground, over 500 yards. And considering uh, the shortened season, 500 yards rushing of 5.7 per clip, uh, nice production out of him late in the season uh, in the ground game. Speaking of the ground game, yeah, go go ahead. Well, no, I was just going to say that he just he looked much more confident. Um, I, th I think he was a little gun shy a lot of the time there, and and uh, he was running out of uh, necessity or running just to run instead of running, you know, as a designed run. And you know, running out of necessity is what I was trying to say. Um, I think once he settled down, and uh, then he can show what he can do when he's not under pressure like that. And uh, he makes those mistakes. And, uh, you know, I think he knows right now as well that uh, if he can be as accurate as he was showing there at the end of last year, then he doesn't need to run as much. And uh, you don't see those 20-plus rushes a game from the quarterback position, which ends up, you know, five of those end up on the ground bouncing around for anybody to recover a lot of the times. So, uh yeah, I, I'm looking. I'm looking for this team to, uh, or for at least Adrian Martinez to be able to protect the ball much more this year, and uh, be much more efficient as as a quarterback. And confidence is what I think is going to drive that. 